Well, it was, a, it was a great battle. Miami's obviously a good team. If you were here, you watched it, so were we. Jacob was outstanding today. We just didn't get that big hit like we did yesterday or this series would have flipped in our favor. There was a higher level of focus put on pitching this year from the very first day of fall baseball. And it's obviously paid dividends because pitching and defense do win championships and offense comes and goes. And today it wasn't here. And we pitched and played defense both. So had they all three showed up, we would have won today. But Chris Madrinsky was lights out yesterday. I thought Nick gave us a quality start on Friday but there was just too many walks sprinkled in. It was a tough day, wind blowing out, but it was blowing out for both teams. But Chris was outstanding yesterday, seven strong, and then Jacob seven strong today. One hit, one run. We gave up three hits today and lost this ball game. I mean, that tells you the story. I think it comes down to this. I think if we are, we're in control of our destiny, we're not eliminated from anything. This will be the fifth year in a row we make the MAC tournament if we should do so with six teams qualifying. But we need to win the series at Ohio, and I think we're going to need to win the series at Ball State unless something shuffles in between. The nice thing is to know that we really are in control of our own destiny. Whatever needs to be done, we can still do it. We don't need help at this point. So I like that we have figured out after a rough start of one and five, and this would have been our fifth series in a row. We came up short. I think our guys will finish strong. Matter of fact, I know they will. We always do.